<laughs> Something interesting is happening right now. There's cows over there. Don't know if you can see them. But they're all along there. Some of them are actually walking this way. We'll see if they come down here, but it looks like they're going to head towards that big tree over there for some shade. So there's like a big tree there. So they're heading all they're heading over there, having a feed, heading over there for a shade. We did see some cow poo around this area, but it's not really much shade for him here. So I think they're going to go chill over there for the night. That's probably their little night spot. Uh, update. <laughs> there's the cows. And they're literally, there's four of them on that track, just staring us down. They're just staring us down. They're like, I don't know, man, do we go down there? <laughs> do we go down there, man? This is four of them staring us down. Like, it's so funny. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> you can see all the cows, but they're all just cruising along. All along there on the horizon line. Look at them all, just grazing having a good time those four that just deaf stared us for like half an hour but the, they're still looking over you you can see that one there he's just look he's looking at us it's like, what are these guys doing on my grazing paddock man <laughs> who cares anyway waiting a bit i'm gonna have dinner and stuff soon i've got a, a rod over there but you can't really see it it's got bait on it and stuff with a little uh silver bells on them so if the fish bite, this is silver bell should go off and then I'll be able to hear him, but it's so windy, I don't even think I'll hear him. <laughs> but um, tonight I'm gonna try, I'll just get a chair and then sit up there near the water, cast it in, just have a sit and yeah, probably get a flashlight out or something and then I'll um, record some footage when, if I can, yeah, catch my first salmon or trout, eh? We did it. We got fire. We got to do shush. Man. Man make fire. Man. Man make fire. This didn't even drop. But it hadn't, it hadn't even dropped. It hadn't even hit the bottom. Oh I wow. I was like, oh I grabbed the spoon and I just saw this mad colours on my spoon that I bought online and I'm like, I'm gonna try this spoon. Well, I casted it over there, it didn't even hit the bottom and this fish Pink smashed it, like it smashed it. <laughs> it's a big one. Like it's got some weight to it. Oh. Yeah. So I'm being very careful with it because I have really light line. Ooh. <gasps> oh my god, baby, it looks so huge. It's a big head. It's huge? Yeah, well, it's, it's quite a large size, but I don't want it to snap my line because I only have two pounds on that. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> we see how it jumps up again. I don't have a net, so I need to try and get it on the bank and then just drag it, but I don't have a net. Fuck, I did not expect fish to be this big. Holy shit, that thing is massive. Come on, come up, come up. Oh, baby, my first. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to lose it. Come on now, come up, come up. now come up come up come up there you go come on come on come on Oh my god, it's huge. Holy shit. It's huge. Oh my god, baby. Holy it's shit. <laughs> my first ever. And how good is that? Wow, what a beast. Oh. 
What a beast. Congratulations, yeah, these fish baby. Are amazing. <laughs> wow. Probably oh, going to put this fella back on the water. Um, we do need to go and get a pliers so I can get these hooks out of this poor fella. But that is amazing. My things feel amazing yeah. in the flesh. Yeah, oh my being alive. gosh, look at here. Just going to sit it there for a minute. Uh, where's the pliers? I, I can get it. You can get these fucking hooks out. Um, in the car. Okay, I'll get, get it. Car, get it. Fine. Thought I'd show you guys how the sunset's looking. Look at that. How beautiful is that? So, I'm still pretty excited after catching my fish because I was stoked. It was like, I cast it once with this lure that I bought from eBay that came in like this pack that just looked like a little fish with like, I'll show you guys later what it looks like. And then um, I cast it one straight ahead, didn't get anything. And then I cast it and kind of like wigged out my cast and it went like way left of me. And as soon as it hit the water, it was like one, two, bang, fish. And it was just boom. Like I only have like 2.7 pound braid line on it. Don't even have a leader. Um, and yeah, I, I still got it. So I was pretty stoked about that. Like, oh my God. But then, yeah, just wanted to show you guys the beautiful sunset that we got going here. And then also give you a quick little look of your campsite. Here we go going. Still haven't put our tent up yet, but I've got my shower going. Got there. The hot water. Got a shower. Should be done now. Put that there. Look at that. Nice hot water for the shower. I don't know if you can see the steam coming off. So put a bit of cold water in there, hot water. Runs up this little pump that I'll put inside there, which runs up there. It's a 12 volt, it goes into the car, and then that's got like a little extended hose so I can have my shower. And that is how we're gonna have a shower. Mm. Oh my god. Good morning, my peeps. Um, it is like 6 a.m., somewhere around there. Um, yeah, pretty cloudy up in the sky and stuff actually see a lot clearer on this camera than you do what I'm seeing right now so there we are very cloudy which kind of sucks there's no sunrise right now well sun hasn't even poked out yet so we'll see hopefully we'll get to see some kind of a sun but uh, we're gonna set up some rods um, we'll see how it goes today hopefully we can get some more we'll just go around the whole place we'll figure it out so like uh, that's the camping set up there because I haven't actually showed you guys what it looks like when the whole thing is set up. So here you go. So we got the car and then the awning. Right, we got our fridge and stuff. I'm busy making uh, making uh, making some uh, hot water and then uh, we've got this back part. Take you guys over here and then I'll walk you out from the outside so you can see how cool the awnings and the side bits are so that blocks view from people up coming up that way and then uh yeah got my six man or my four man annex attached to our rooftop tent which is right there pretty cool it's pretty neat and then i'll show you guys the inside because um inside's pretty Pretty nice. I'll take you in from the side, the side door. There's the side. We've got a little toilet. There's Cam's <laughs> And Then uh, the ladder that goes up to your tent. So that's how we set up right now, and let's we'll see how we go. <sighs> so for those that are wondering, what lure I was using yesterday, it was that little guy, little silver slop spoon with a rainbow-like feather bit on the back. So it looks kind of like a little fish. The swimming action of this, the swimming action of this was amazing. I've only casted it twice before I caught that fish yesterday, but I've got the gold one now, because it's a bit dark. So I've got the gold one on. And we'll see if the gold one uh, gets a fish as well. And then we're gonna try some of these longer, all these longer lures. And then I've got that big fish in there, some poppers and stuff. But the poppers and the hard bodies didn't really work too well. Seems like they like these spoons a lot, so we'll try the spoons out again today, see how we go. 
If uh, the spoons don't go any good, um, we'll probably change it up. Because I've got a lot of grubs and stuff in here, like crickets, grubs, and all the different types of lures that we can try out to try and uh, see if we can get these, try and catch some nice fish. So we'll figure it out. We've got tiny little swimmers over there if we need them. But um, the size fish I caught on that thing yesterday was amazing. So we're just going to keep trying and see how we go. We turn that light off, we don't need it. Anyway, so what we're doing. Hmm? Whoa. Oh, it's so calm the water right now. Yeah. Whoa. I need to go get a rod out there. Whoa, that's so nice. Time for a fishing. <laughs> Don't get cold out there, so cold out there. Put that Lucy. Lucy's getting warmed up in here. The cold shivering baby doesn't want to go out there. <laughs> Speak. 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 Roar. Roar. Speak. Speak. No. Speak. No. Speak. Speak.
such an intense moment driving on this road. That's it for PJ. We are we are out of here. That's the last of PJ right there behind us. And then uh, we're going to be heading home. So if any of you liked the content that you saw, please leave a comment down below. Leave a like, a thumbs up, hit a subscribe. It really helps us out. Here's Kenzie there. Lucy over there. Yay. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. We'll check you in the next one.